So I'm going to start off by applying this primer from Smashbox. This is a primer and moisturizer in one. So it's really good if you're feeling a bit dehydrated. Ugh. As my base, I'm going to mix the Fenty Beauty foundation with the Too Faced one this way. And I want to mix these two because this one is a bit too olive and this one is a bit too yellow. So together they make the perfect match for me at the moment. And I'm barely applying any foundation underneath my eyes because the more product you have underneath your eyes, the more they will crease. So I basically only want concealer underneath my eyes and that's it. Maybe a bit of powder. I'm now just going to do my eyebrows really quick and I'm starting off by using a clear brow gel. And to fill them in, I'm going to use the Benefit Brow Pen in the shade number 4. I'm just going to apply some Tarte Shape Tape. To... To highlight and conceal. And I'm also going to add some of the Too Faced Born This Way concealer in the shade Light. Just because the Tarte one is quite light, so I just want to add something that's not as light. Whoop. I'm just going to spray my Beauty Blender a bit with my Smashbox Primer Water. I don't know where you guys are from, but the weather here in Sweden today is absolutely amazing. It's been snowing quite a lot lately and it's been so grey and we don't see the sun a lot this time of the year, which is really depressing. And the sun is just so important when it comes to your health and vitamin D and all of that. I feel like Tarte Shape Tape might be a bit too drying for me at the moment. I'm just very dehydrated. I know that I say that in every single video, but I am. Um, and it just settles in any of my fine lines, which is really annoying. <sighs> if you can hear someone snoring, that's my dog. She is a French bulldog and you know how they are. She's not always snoring, but when she sleeps on her back or something like that, she snores and that's what she's doing. My camera stopped recording, but I did set my under eyes and my T-zone with the Too Faced Born This Way Ethereal Setting Powder. And for the rest of my face, I'm going to use the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Powder in number one. And I'm going to use a Morphe G4 brush to apply it. And I really like to press it into my skin. And 
now we're just gonna move on to our eyes. I'm just gonna add a dab of this to face born this way concealer. And then I'm gonna use the Charlotte. Whoop! That was dark. I have definitely used that brush for something. And for my eyes, I'm gonna use the Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette just because a lot of you guys wanted me to use it and. I thought why not because I haven't used it in a while and I absolutely love this palette. I'm just going to do a very simple look though, so just so you know. Uh, but I'm going to start off by applying maybe a mix of raw sienna and burnt orange. And I'm using a Morphe M533 brush. And I'm just going to apply this into my crease I'm now gonna apply the shade Real Gar, which is the orange shade in the palette. And I'm also applying this into my crease, but I'm not blending it as far up as I did with the other shades. I'm then going back to the first brush we used, but I'm not going to add any more product. I'm just going to blend. And when I'm blending, I just like to go in circles and then I just go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth and then circles. I'm now going to use the Morphe M507 with Real Gar again and I'm going to apply this on my lower lash line. I'm then going to use the shade Cypress Umber closest to my lash line and I'm using this flat definer brush from Sigma.
So I'm now just going to apply some mascara and lashes. I'm in such a hurry now. I have like 15 minutes to go. I just realized that this is basically a warm toned smoky eye, which I've done like a lot of lately. My skin has been so bad lately and it's so annoying but it's been clearing up a lot in the last couple of weeks because I've been eating a lot healthier and I really think about what I put in my body and I think that definitely helps my skin a lot. And since I'm eating a lot better now, I'm also working out a lot more, which is a lot of fun and I absolutely love being back at the gym. But when it comes to my diet, I just really think about the nutrients and vitamins I put in my body. And I've only been doing this for the last two weeks. It was two weeks yesterday, I think. But I can already see a difference and feel a difference in my body, which is insane and crazy and it really motivates me. I'm just gonna bronze up my skin a bit with my Too Faced uh, powder. But I've been thinking about doing a and I've been thinking about doing a video about what I eat and what I do at the gym to tone my body and and basically what I do to prepare my body for summer because I feel like you have to start now if you want to have any results for summer and you obviously don't have to do anything if you don't feel like it or if you're not into that I'm just really into eating healthy and working out my whole family is and I just really really enjoy it and I'm also very lucky because my brother is a personal trainer and he has also studied nutrition so he helps me out a lot and he's actually the one that got me into this diet type of thing and I can really see results coming which is so much fun. Uh, I'm now just gonna highlight a bit but yeah so if I need help with anything he always helps me out with my workout or how to think about my food and all of that and it is very handy and we also work out a lot together which is so good very good for me maybe not for him i'm now just gonna apply some of this charlotte tilbury blush but yeah i just thought it could be fun for you guys to come along to the gym maybe and see what i eat or maybe get a few tips and tricks i don't know if you guys find this interesting but if you do, then let me know and I will definitely do a video like that. I'm now just going to add some of this Morphe setting spray. Okay, so I think we're done um this is the finished makeup look i really hope that you liked it i am in such a rush right now <sighs> i know that this is maybe not the most fun eyeshadow look but it's a very simple makeup look that i think you could wear both daytime and nighttime which is so yeah i hope that you guys are having an amazing day i'm gonna take my dog out for a walk in the sun and the snow and then i'm gonna go to the gym subscribe if you want to see more videos and don't forget to hit that notification bell because otherwise you will not be notified and that would be sad that's it i will talk to you soon bye <laughs>